Bet on Aces, 95.9 K Ace Country. Right behind me in Discovery Park are where the proposed rapid infiltration basin systems will be located. News 46 recently caught up with Nye County Commissioner Dan Schinhoffen and the Director of Planning, Daryl Lacey. According to the pair, there are few of these in Nye County and numerous within the state of Nevada. Uh, we have them operating in this valley already. We have for years, since 2006. They're operating all over Nye County and all over the state. They are uh, uh, inspected and approved by NDEP, which is the authority for that, and the PUC. About a year ago, when uh, UICN was asking about their rate case, we uh, kibitzed that we would like ribs, and we asked for certain things about monitoring and stuff in that. Um, I know a lot of people are upset now about them and concerned. Uh, this is not injection. This doesn't go right into the aquifer. It's going to go through at least 50 feet of rock and soil, the best filter on the planet is the planet and uh, I see no need to hinder this project anymore because again they've operated safely for years and I expect this one to do the same. It's treated to category B um, which and and when they treat it they treat it with chlorine but they also treat it with the UV lights that kills a lot of the trace elements and uh, no matter what you're gonna have some trace elements in water and and it's gonna go past through all that rock and soil Unlike the 11,000 septic tanks we have in this valley that are not treated, that do, that's why you have leach lines and why you have to have a percolation test because some of that water does go down through the aquifer. The Board of County Commissioners has an appeal coming up in front of them. The uh, Regional Planning Commission approved UICN to install some ribs at their wastewater treatment plant over at the Willow Creek Golf Course. Mm -hmm. That's a standard uh, process for handling uh, treated effluent from these wastewater plants. We have other ones in the county. We have other ones uh, throughout the state. It's something that is a, uh, the standard process for uh, cleaning up and uh, making sure we don't lose the water resources. We live in a desert. We, we can't waste water. And we're trying to look at every source of water in the valley and make sure that we are handling it appropriately. The majority of the water at Willow Creek is going to be used for irrigation of the golf courses and the uh, the park. Uh, the ribs are essentially just a backup. The uh, state uh, in-depth Nevada Department of Environmental Protection requires the ribs in case the uh, what they found in winter time and stuff like that. The uh, golf courses aren't using near as much water so they have uh, excess water that they need to get rid of and so that's really what the ribs are. It's really more of a backup than your, your primary process for dealing with the water. The proposal by Utilities Incorporated will soon be on the BOCC's agenda. We will keep you posted. I am Jennifer Moots at Discovery Park for News 46.